Right, we're filming again. <laughs> Should be flashing red. Yeah. 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 Yep. Yeah, it's all. It's a nice. This video in actually, it's um, it's a good sort of add-on to to the to the motorbiking because it's like it it makes the motorbiking more enjoyable. Yeah. Because you can see where you've been yeah. afterwards. I've seen yeah. more and more bikes as it comes. Yeah. I mean, a lot. I, I wondered whether it were like, you know, in case any, they had an accident. Yeah, yeah. I think a lot do wear them for that. Yeah. And I think that's probably a good thing for that. Yeah. But there's also a lot that sort of do these, uh, do the, well, they call it vlogging, don't they? Yeah. Taking videos and that and uh, sharing them on the internet. So, uh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, it's. Uh, it's quite a nice laid back hobby if you can get into it. Yeah. And that just plugs into your laptop and Yeah, it, well they have a they have one of them uh, micro SD cards in bike. Yeah. It's only a, ever such a small thing. And um, you take that out and put it into your computer and then it just all the footage you've taken is on there. Um, or you can have, I think. Can you, you, can you edit it then? Yeah, yeah. If you if you're clever enough, I'm not really at that stage yet. Yeah. But you can uh, you can purchase these editing applications where you can edit your videos yeah. and cut bits out, add bits in yeah. if you want. But at the minute, I'm just using it for recording what I've been doing. But yeah, I mean, some of them, if you go on YouTube, uh, some of the lads that edit them and do these videos they're very professional you know have you seen Richie Vida? no I haven't, I haven't seen go any go on go on YouTube and uh, have you got internet and everything yeah well go I mean, on YouTube went, before I went to Europe I looked at a few for like yeah. routes through Europe yeah go on uh, go on internet uh, YouTube uh, there's one guy called Richie Vida. he's he does a lot of stuff and he's, he's some of his stuff's brilliant yeah some of his film work and that and a lot, there's like, other people as well you know, I mean, there's nothing on telly one night. Yeah. It's a nice bit of viewing, you know. But yeah, anyway, here we go. Hey ho! Oh, you're waiting. <laughs> Martin's waiting for us. We've been trouble. Two minutes. <laughs> We're just chewing fat. <laughs> you not listening. Right, we've just had his breakfast. Absolutely brilliant. And now we're headed out over the snake pass towards uh, Lady Bower. Uh, it's a route that we've ridden before. And we'll go out and uh, get over there and then we'll go and have a, a coffee at a pub that we stop at on the way over there. So we're off to uh, over the snake pass. <laughs> Just got to get through Glossop. It's a busy little town. Uh, yeah, we've had a lovely, lovely breakfast. I think it was about... Um, Four pound for a breakfast, fiver with a cup of tea, sausage, two sausage, bacon, beans, tomatoes, toast, fried bread, and an egg. So, can't go wrong at that price. Yep, it's flashing, so it must be filming. I think when uh, we get up on uh, on this road, I'll not be talking as much. I'll just let you share the ride with me. 
It's a nice ride over the snake. Uh, I expect it'll be busy. And there's a 50 mile an hour speed restriction on it, which has been in place a few years now. I think there's been quite a few accidents on it, so they've put a 50 mile an hour speed limit on it. Uh, just waiting to get through these lights. We're turning right. Yeah, they've changed again to red. <clears throat> Gonna be here a while. Uh, no problem. It's just a waiting game. It's, uh, can't do anything about it, you just have to wait. It's, uh, it's just a waiting game. Just checking to make sure I got my wallet. I have. It's under the seat. I uh, I don't know whether it's an age thing, but I get a bit forgetful sometimes. Uh, oh. Just need to reassure myself. I'd got my wallet. There's nothing worse than thinking you've lost your wallet. Right, we're off. Let's hope we can get through this time. We should do. We should do. Leave all this traffic. It is a very busy place, Glossop. You've got two or three major roads all coming in all at once, and they all meet on this junction. Right, we're through. Oh, that's it, we're through, we're through, we're on his way. On his way. Yeah, it'd be interesting. Uh, be interesting to see what this footage comes out like later on. Bit of good weather brings people out as well, so that's why things are a bit busier. Everybody's out and about enjoying the sunshine. Oh, we're pulling in. Yeah? 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 Shall I go first? Hey? Shall I go first? Shall I go first and you can come past me? Yeah, we can just keep looking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
just make a bit more. Yeah, definitely, yeah. yeah. Tell Kevin. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're just saying um, when we go up this road they're going to come past and we're going to change places a few times. Just try and make it a bit more interesting. That's nice, nicer Martin. He's that type of guy, he's, he's very thoughtful. He's a, he's a very genuine guy. Yep, nothing, uh, there's nothing not to like about him. nothing not to like about him is uh, he's a really genuine guy so top marks for that one all right so as I get up here I think they'll come past me and they'll see them and we'll just keep changing places I think make it a bit more interesting up over the snake pass what I'll try and do as I go over here is uh, I'll try and keep away from other traffic if I can so I can get a clear run at it if you get stuck behind other stuff it tends to spoil the ride a bit Here he comes, here comes Martin. Here comes Martin, yeah. And here comes Kevin. Here comes Kevin and his beamer, that's nice. Get round here and uh, probably get in front of them again and just do it like that. Ah, it makes it a bit more interesting I guess. So here we go folks, this is the Snake Pass. Enjoy the ride with us. Here they come again, it's Martin and it's Deville. Here comes Kevin on his BMW. Oh, he's gone in front. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is Martin's idea this. It's not a bad idea actually. <laughs> Makes it a bit more interesting. Oh yeah, the snake pass. Here we go. Ask Kevin.
So they've got a, a 50 mile an hour speed limit on this road now. So. There's been quite a few accidents on here, I think, over the years. But they've had to do what they've had to do, I guess. Road surface is bad. There's Kevin again. Martin again. A little bit breezy up here. All right, we're all thinking on the same wavelength. Lads have let me through again. So I'll get down here and I'll come past again. <laughs> I like playing musical chairs. It's a nice road this. Some of these corners are nice. If you can get yourself set up right for them as you come you come into them, they're quite pleasant. So We've got um, another biker behind us. Oh, there we go. Went through. He's gone. Oh God. Shorts on. No protection on his legs. That lad on bike. Went out for leather. Oh, that's a recipe for disaster in my opinion. But uh, ultimately. It's not my body, is it? Here they come again, lads. It's Kevin. Martin. Lovely down here.
Martin. Kevin's a bit by behind us actually, he's coming now. Here he comes. Oh, it's nice that. Riding with your brothers. Having a good time. Brothers in arms. It's got to be one of the best things ever. Riding a motorbike. 